Hello, this is Adazba, and today I made another DF.io mod, the <coughs> DF.io custom background mod. The shader mod allows you to add shadows to DF.io. This one allows you to add a custom background. So you now you have this background, it's just a grid. Now, first of all, you have a button that can toggle it, so you can turn it on and off, and on and off, and on and off. However, what you can do is you can actually get an image pasted into this box over here and of course you need to turn off the background and there you have a custom image as the background and I'm just gonna tell you right now there's no editing involved here this is all in-game none of this is edited and there's an actual script you'll be able to get to do this yourself in-game and sadly, I haven't added a way to move this yet, because I have no idea how the DF.io movement system works. And even if I, like, found a way to sync it up with, like, the player's move speed, I'd only be able to do it for, like, certain speeds and stuff. I'd have to configure it for every possible upgrade configuration and, like, the speed of the full level 45 tank and all that. Like, every level of tank. So if I do end up doing that, I'll probably just do it for level 45 and at like certain speed levels. They're quite hard to do. But I might be able to get the data from like Spade Squad or somebody like that. Something like that. So the, the weird glitch that is currently happening is that you can't actually change any of the data on this text box. You have to do Control A and then Control X to remove it or control Z, and as you can see as I removed the URL it disappeared over here. So I'm just going to copy this image over here as well. And here you have another image. This is something I made in Blender a while ago. And as you can see it's being used as the background right now. So if you want a custom background in df.io, like you use a script, it works the same way as the other one, you just make a new user script with Tamper Monkey and then paste in the code. So yeah, that's the that's really all this is. DF.io custom backgrounds. So uh thank you for watching. Have a good day. Download link is in the description.